again. Hey, I'm going to show you about the bobby pins. Okay, so I know in my last video when I talked about the U pins, how I dogged on bobbies. And what I was dogging on were the dime store, Walmart, whatever, dime a dozen bobby pins. Okay, that's what I was referring to when I said that they bend out of shape and they poke you in the back of the head. And that's what I was referring to. I absolutely love Lilla Rose bobby pins. I think they're just so pretty and they are so strong. So let me show you. Um, in our collection, we have a lot from the super simple to the super blingy. We do have um, the uh, classic bobby pins, which are just the plain bobby pins. They come in a set of eight for $10 and they come in, f I'm trying to remember, four or five finishes. I feel like there's five finishes, but I could be wrong. Um, but they're absolutely amazing and they sell out, out all the time. Um, so they're super strong and super amazing. Um, we have something simple like the hummingbird here. And then we have something super blingy like this amazing peacock feather um, that's called Phoebe. Um, we have, they come in singles or pairs. You can buy them um, every once in a while. You can find a set of four that you can get them a little bit cheaper. So it's um, kind of a bonus if you find some of those. Um, so basically, I just kind of wanted to show you how they, here's a coffee cup, how they just range from um, one to the other. There's just so many different kinds. I'm just showing you some that I have here on hand. Um, I like these two. These are pretty neat. So anyway, with our bobby pins, um, and I'm just going to show you on these last ones that I showed you, they um, are super, super strong. Okay. So you have this strong, thick bobby. It's not a thin bobby like the, um, like the dime store ones are. And when I open mine, I actually run my fingernail up underneath it and then I hold it open because it's so strong, okay? Um, and as you can see, once I let go, you can see how strong it is. It was actually pulling on my finger. Um, so when I go to put it in, I keep it open and then I slide it on and then I let go because if I don't, I could be like yanking my hair. Um, this is the one product that we have that if you're not careful, it could pull your hair out um, because they are so strong. So when I go to pull mine out, I kind of, I kind of try to open them just a little bit and pull. Um, or I, if I can't do that, I hold my hair as I pull so that it actually doesn't pull it out. Um, super, super strong. Amazing. I've given you a couple ideas in my hair of what you can do with them. Um, there is this little trick that I will show you in a short video at some point in time. Um, but this I have, I love these. This is called Demi. I'm not sure if it's in the store right now, but, um, they're just so pretty. And so I sometimes keep my little flyaways here on the side with those because like the entire pen practically is covered and pretty. Um, so I've got that on both sides. Something else you could do try to line myself up here, um, is in the bun that you have, which I actually used my Lux U pens without the decoration to keep my bun up. And then I just kind of decorated it real pretty with the two, um, orchid bobby pens. So, so many different ideas that you can do with the bobby pens. I've seen people do the little twisty and I don't, I've never figured that out, but like where you twist little bits, little strands of hair, and then you bring it back in the back and then cross them and that's just so pretty. And I've never been able to do that with my hair, probably because my hair is so slick. By the time I get one done, I can't get the other one to stay. I don't know. Anyway, try, trying to figure that one out. But um, our bobbies are absolutely amazing. So if you have questions, um, absolutely ask and comment below what you would like to use the bobby pins in. And if you are really interested, pop over to the website and click on the bobbies tab and show me your favorite bobby pin pair.